In this video, we're going to be reviewing the Gonex Top Archery Bow. Uh, it's a 40 pound bow, uh, either for youth or adult. Now, I will tell you as a disclaimer, I have tried multiple times to put this thing together. I would not advise any children to put this thing together. It does come with English instructions right here. And right here is where you have to put the tool on to bend down, bend back your bow to put the strain on. But I'll tell you what, it is a backbreaker. It is very rough and it's tough. But again, I'm going to show you exactly how to do it. It comes with a bag here. The bag has a pocket. It also has shoulder straps. It also has, you know, some nice felt inside, some nice padding for your bow and arrow and your arrow so that they don't get, um, you know, scratched up. You got some sh shoulder strings here. This comes, it comes with a, a arrow string. You can see one loop is bigger than the other. The bigger loop will be for the upper limb and the lower loop will be for the lower and the smaller loop will be for the lower limb and I'll show you that in just a minute. A tool to be able to bend back your bow to put on your arrow strain but the only thing is I tell you what this piece right here this piece isn't bad but this piece is this piece slides up and down on the bow and again this arrow rest here made from an alloy metal with a good firm grip here good rubber rubber grip here. Top archery, if you can read it, that means that this is going to be your upper, and of course this is going to be your lower limbs. One is an upper and one is a lower. You're going to see numbers right here on the side. The 6A is going to be your upper and 6B is going to be your lower. It's going to come with a plastic bolt here. This plastic bolt is basically to seat your arrow on top. So I would recommend maybe going to a hardware store and getting a all metal one. And then maybe you can just buy something online that isn't plastic because when you screw it in, it starts to get real tight and it starts to bend and it feels like this bolt right here wants to break so you might need to find something else that uh, isn't plastic. It come with hardware. You do not need any tools. It comes with an Allen wrench. Uh, there are going to be two Allen bolts that you're going to need to tighten down. That is it. It's going to come with, and these are already going to be screwed on to your arrow rest. I just already took them off. It's going to come with two washers. It's going to come with two seats that your Allen bolts will sit in and two Allen bolts. You're going to grab your arrow rest again. This is you can re-top archery, you're going to know that this is going to be your top A and you're going to put it as so. You're going to put it just like this so that you have your bend and it comes and it loops out. That's exactly how they have it. Don't think that it goes the other way, even though that would make logical sense that why wouldn't it bend over like that? It does not go that way. It flips. Washer, seat, and you're going to take your Allen bolt and you're going to put that right through the hole here. Just enough to where you feel it tight. And we're going to do the opposite to the other side. And we're going to tighten it down. All right, so once you have your bow in your hand, you find your top limb, which is this one right here. This is your top limb. Your top limb is going to be getting this piece right here. And they claim that the piece goes just like this. So it's going to sit just like that. But as you can see, this thing moves, OK? So you want to make sure that it doesn't move when you're putting on your bowstring or it's going to it's not going to be nice. So they logical sense would make it to kind of sit right here honestly. Not down here because it's going to be having a hard time trying to bend this smaller back. Smaller is going to go to your lower. So you're going to put your smaller in first. The smaller needs to go The smaller is going to go in like that. You're going to grab your tool here and you're going to place it right over the top just like that. Here is where it gets tricky. So you're going to take your bowstring, okay, because look it, of course you got like, what, four inches to for it to hook on the end. So they state that you take this tool, you wrap it over the top just like that. Just like that, okay. The only problem is when you step on the string, it wants to go way over here, so this doesn't bend back enough. So you have to be very careful when you're lifting up on this. So you're putting a lot of pressure. So let's just go ahead and show you. Definitely need two people to do this. All right. Gonex also sells these arrows as well that are not included. It's going to go right kind of in the middle. You see the seat right here? You're going to be putting it right in the middle. And then you can tell it's different because it's the strings and then it's got this little area right here that you're going to put the arrow. There we go, that one's stuck. 